everyone knows, leprechauns are magical, mischievous, elusive little beings known for their family as well. Once upon a time, in the fabled village of Killarney, there lived a wee lad named Finn O'Flynn. Top of the to ya! Now, cheery, magical leprechauns are notorious for hiding their pots of gold at the ends of rainbows and sometimes even in Swiss banks. But alas, Finn was neither rich, cheerful, nor magical. Quite the contrary. He was dirt poor and oh, so sad. Yes, our little lad in green's got a bad case of the lovesick blues. Oh, woe is me, for I have lost me true love, me beautiful fairy princess. But she's gone, disappeared, run off, thrown the poop even, <laughs> both with me heart and me gold. <laughs> Excuse me, but uh, for a wee lad from Killarney, you don't sound terribly Irish. Killarney, New Jersey, it's right off the turnpike. And you don't look very wee either. Well, I've been eating me lucky turns. They're magically delicious. <laughs> right -o. Well, back to our story. <laughs> Poor, pathetic little Finn believed that only the enchanted music of his flute could charm his beloved fairy princess and her pixie friends into returning home to Killarney. <laughs> so, every evening at twilight, the wee lad played his princess's favorite <laughs> tunes on the flute hoping she would hear his beckoning music and return to her rightful home. Ooh, let's see. Um, me flutes must be in here somewhere. <laughs> How today? Oh, what's this? <laughs> Not me size. Did anybody lose these? You? Are these yours? No? Oh, I thought they might have been. I'm sorry. <laughs> How today? are lovely. Let's make some beautiful music together, baby. <laughs> but unfortunately for Finn O'Flynn, despite long hours of flute practice, his playing left a lot to be desired. <laughs> well, truth be told, he was a lousy musician. I think my foot's broken. <laughs> oh boy. Broken! <laughs> 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 Who's he kidding? <laughs> <laughs> hey, who's laughing at me? They are! Oh, my <laughs> poor ears! I've heard better tootin' at a bean farm! At least you have ears! <laughs> if that's the best playing you can do, we'll never see the beautiful fairy princess again! Wow! Who needs a gold digging fairy anyway? She's not! They're so silly when they try to impress girls! <laughs> hey, we lad! You're gonna need magic to make your flute too! <laughs> You busybody, funny looking fireman animals know about making music, anyways. Did he just call us busybodies? Yes. Well, I never. So he tried everything he could think of to improve his flute playing. My parents bought me flute lessons. I tried shamrock wishing, um, transcendental meditation. Potato. <laughs> <laughs> I even tried some performance enhancing Tai Chi. I think it really helped. <laughs> but who? In fact, his flute playing got worse. And then one night, Finn remembered something he hadn't tried. Magic! Finn had in his possession... A magic wand! Look, it's autographed by Harry Potter. Oh boy. <laughs> Unfortunately, a leprechaun can't make magic of this type all by himself. No, his enchantment requires special assistance. Someone special to magically wave the magic wand while the wee lad plays his flute. Someone to magically wave the magic wand. Well, uh, who looks magical enough to help me out? Oh boy, um, I'm thinking, uh, you, sir, right here. <laughs> and what's your name? John Finnoflin, pleased to meet you. Where are you from, John? Richmond. Richmond? Where in Ireland is that? Come right this way. Give John a big round of applause. Now, John, have you ever used a magical wand before? 
You never have? Oh boy. Oh, there's a first time for everything. <laughs> Here you go. Now, when I say so, you're going to wave that wand around me flute. Are you ready? All right. Wait. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Oh, perfect. All right. Wave it. <laughs> oh, <boy. laughs> no, don't laugh at him. It's all in the wrist. Like this. That's all you got to do. Show me some of your real magic. Now you do it. Kick the leg. Is that even Phantom of the Opera? Hey, that wasn't half bad. <laughs> Something's happening. <laughs> Well, hello, gorgeous. Who's wearing that smelly perfume? Laddie, you must be my date from Match.com. Oh, no, 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 It wasn't me. It was him. I don't even own a computer. Oh, wait till I tweet about this. Seriously? I got all dolled up for this? For him. Boys, I know when I'm not wanted. There's plenty more bachelors in the next town over. I hear that French mayor of Aquitaine is a handsome little devil. <laughs> Au revoir, Kalani! And I thought my last date was scary. Kids, let this be a lesson to you. I'm never going online again. <laughs> thanks a lot, buddy. You've been a big help. <laughs> yeah, oh. thanks for nothing. <laughs> she... You know, Fiddle Flame, oh. if it were me trying to conjure up a fairy princess, no. I'd find someone pure of heart to help. Darn tootin'. Pure of heart. Pure of heart, you say? Oh my, he isn't the sharpest shillelagh in the box, is he? Don't. Jeez, how long is this show? Hey. <laughs> the fireworks, feathers are gonna fly. Chicken, we've got like four hours for the fireworks. <laughs> Mr. O'Flynn. Wait! I get it! <laughs> okay. Finally! I don't need a laddie, I need a little lassie, a little girl, pure of heart. Oh, let's see. And the green, right here. And what's your name? Ashley, how old are you? You're six or from right up here, Ashley. Give Ashley a big round of applause. I love the green shirt. Very lucky. <laughs> now, Ashley, do you believe in fairies and princesses? You do? Well, will you help me bring back me fairy princess? You will! <laughs> this time it's a work for sure. Alright, hold on to that. Now, when I say so, wave that wand high in the sky, alright? We might even spin a little bit. Are you 